Hey everybody, what is going on? So as you can tell in front of me, I have the Elite WrestleMania series Goldberg figure. I have been waiting for an updated Goldberg figure for quite some time now, and we finally got one instead of a flashback or the one that came with the Raw ring back in 2016 or 17. I don't remember off the top of my head, but it was a Toys R Us exclusive, but now we have this one, so let me get it unboxed for y'all. So now that we have Goldberg unboxed, at first glance is a really, really nice figure. He comes with a Paul Ellering head because the whole set of Goldberg, Edge, China, and Shawn Michaels build a Paul Ellering Build-A-Figure. The Build-A-Figure pieces come with each figure. He also comes with two open hands, which I think is really nice besides just the closed hands. And I'm pretty sure he's the first figure to come with this blue Universal Championship belt. Um, Usually with some of these Mattel figures, sometimes the paint apps are messed up. But from the face down to the trunks, the paint application is really nice. And if we turn him around, you can also see that the trunks are updated with the blacked out black and white Goldberg logo. We have his signature tattoo up here on his shoulder, as well as, and let me see if I can get to it. The tattoo right here under his arm. All in all, I think Mattel did a really, really nice job with this set down to the selection we have this goldberg from wrestlemania 36 and like i was saying earlier i wanted our current goldberg really bad so it's nice to have this one for the collection along with china from wrestlemania 17 Shawn michaels from wrestlemania 9 and edge from wrestlemania 22. if you see these in stores i highly suggest picking them up but if you're like me and don't want to wait for them to hit stores Head over to Ringside Collectibles and pick these bad boys up now. Thanks for watching. Please click like. Please subscribe. Thanks, y'all, and stay tuned for more figure reviews.